I'm going to find all possible rational zeros for this, so I'm going to start off here. Um, my potential rational zeros are going to be um, factors of negative 4, so plus or minus 1, <coughs> or, or 4, uh, plus or minus 2, and plus or minus 4. So I'll start off with the simple ones. I'm going to start off with negative 1. It's negative 1, and my coefficient's 1, and then... 3, and then there's no um, x term, and then negative 4. So negative 1, negative 1, 2, negative 2, negative 2, uh, this becomes 2, and we've got a remainder of negative 2, so that's not correct. I'm going to guess it's probably going to be negative 2, or 2. Alright, so, um, 1, 3, 0, negative 4. Alright, it's crossed. So, um, 1, negative 2, 1, negative 2, negative 2, becomes 4, becomes 0. Okay, good. So this means negative 2 is a solution. Try 2, 1, 3, 0, negative 4. So I get 1, 2, 5, 5, 5. Uh, 10, I get 6. That's not a solution. Let's try negative 4. There may just be 1. Uh, 1, 3, 0, negative 4. Bring us down 1, negative 4. It gives me negative 1. It gives me 4. It gives me 4. It gives me 16. It gives me 12. Alright, so um, pretty sure based off of all this, our only solution is going to be negative 2, which means it only crosses the uh, x-axis once. Uh, that's our only real solution. So probably just negative 2 in this case. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. All right.